What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today's video is about a program that lets you configure your Logitech mouse, both wireless and wired. Now this is called the Piper and it has a list of supported devices and there's screenshots of the program as you can see. Looks pretty nifty. Something goes wrong. It's basically cheese for you. Uh, this is controlled by a service called Ratbag which honestly is ridiculous, but it's Linux. So now we've got two mice to configure. One is a G502 and the other one is a G602. Now to get the G602 working, what I had to do is I had to head into the terminal. I had to do LS USB. Now what this does is it shows you the ID of your mouse because each 602 is different than the last. Next, what I had to do is this. We had to do sudo nano slash user slash share slash rat bag or lib rat bag slash logitech dash g602 slash device. In doing this, we entered our password and I entered my device match for my USB right here. In doing so, I hit control S and control X one to save and one to exit and once that was done we were able to see the g602 inside of piper now there is an installation guide right here on fedora it's just sudo dnf install piper arch is pacman dash capital s piper with also sudo and sudo apt install piper for debian sudo apt install piper for ubuntu there's an older version as well available, and OpenSUSE is sudo zyper install piper. And of course, there's Solus, if you are one of the five people that are using that distro. So we do have it installed, and you will find this in the description below. We are going to go open up Piper, and as you can see, it lets me choose my G602 and my Logitech Hero. I'm going to choose this one because this one's actually proper and showing up right. It allows you to adjust your report polling rate. I'm at a thousand hertz. And as you can see, I've got 24 hertz DPI. Uh, I have more precision that way. And I have my buttons all mapped out and ready to go. Button one, two, and three set up for MMOs. And you could pretty much customize this any way you see fit, of course. And your, LOD, your LEDs are something that will not work here, but you can use another device or another program that comes with it well it doesn't come with it that you can install pretty easily that is called open rgb as you can see i have my zones collected and if i do this and well actually i can just apply to all devices and then everything goes dark but that's because it is dark so if i do this and then i hit apply i'm good to go and now my whole laptop is just turned blue but I'm not the type of guy. I'm more, yeah, I find that color is a lot better in the nighttime anyway. So there we go. Now, minus its shortcomings, I do find this is a pretty solid program as it does have multiple profiles. So uh, if you need to switch profiles on the fly like this, uh, you can also adjust, I guess, your buttons to change your dpi you know resolution switch you can apply that to any button you want i've not tested this with more mice because i don't really have more than just this but i figure this is a cool program to take a look at now i know my mic sounds different there's nothing i could do about that i am away for a couple of days uh probably a week i'm still going to try to do videos and content the best that i can we're doing this on my laptop which has nabora and yeah See, I don't want to get COVID. And if I go home, I get COVID. So I'm going to just stay in the nice, you know, COVID-free zone of life for a bit. Anyway, if you found this video interesting, leave a comment. Let me know. And if you like this video, thank you very much. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new to Linux. I've got tons of guides to help you out. They're in the description below uh, under Linux guides, you know, or... There's a card that pops up that says, if you want to learn Linux, click here, do that. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, everybody.